So we've got just loads and loads and loads of wood. We don't even know if we're floating. John and I are gonna try and canoe a canoe, probably 100 pounds overweight across the lake. I mean, we are very technically floating. And here comes the storm. Close to the shore, right at left. Because there's no way we make it across in time. And at least this way, if we swamp, we're close to land. Go. I look once more just around the river bend. tip when it's hot out you dress cool yeah okay John and I have returned with wood that is a unit of one canoe load as much wood as we could fit in John's canoe with two people considering how humid it got after the rain and the wind was nice even on the water Kara really didn't like it when I left. She was trying to like get in the boat with John and I, but eventually she came back. Thanks for watching her, guys. You're the best. Anytime, dude. The best Happy, birthday, Happy birthday, Sam. Happy birthday, Sam. Happy birthday. Usually we're all about harvesting wood, but Sam said that for her birthday she wanted us to just buy wood. What you doing, John? Just organizing my uh, tackle box, going through everything, sorting it by hard body, soft body, you know, whether it's gonna be on the surface or underneath the water. Take inventory of what I actually have. What kind of fish are you going after? Uh, let's start with some panfish. Panfish and smallmouth. My plan is to take a weighted head, jig head, and put a worm on it, and then just jig the worm. The live bait might uh, be a little more appetizing. What's your, uh, what's your plan there, John? My plan? I'd really like to use some of my spinners to hook the bass. Yeah, man. Or not bass, uh, pike. Or bass, yeah, I guess. I mean, I'll Yeah, I guess anything, anything I, right? Anything I catch, I'll be like, look at this fish. Guys at the dock told Sam and I that there were bass out there. But then we talked to the conservation officer, and he, she said there were some killer pike. Hopefully they uh, like the worms. Oh, I hope they like the worms. You know, we're going after pike now. We picked up some more hardcore gear because we were not equipped to deal with an actual pike hook. Stay tuned. We'll catch some fish later, man. Dick tip. Make sure any line that you clip off stays in your boat and you throw it away when you get back. We're all just saddling up. Getting our canoes ready for fishing. That's John's boat right there. And that's Dick and Sam in the green. And Kara and I in blue. Kind of looking stormy, so we're thinking we might get out on the lake before it hits. Uh, the plan's to fish till dark. We'll see how that goes. Maybe we'll catch some pike. Maybe we'll catch some panfish. Dick tip. Make sure to put a life jacket on your dog when you're in a boat, even if you think it's a strong swimmer. Okay, so we've been paddling up wind a while. I'm gonna set myself up now to drift down with the wind and follow the shoreline. I'm gonna toss a worm and a bobber out one side and then cast the shoreline out the other side of the canoe. Seems like great weather for it. It's just overcast, starting to rain. Just stick to dark colors and see how that goes. So we're just getting the worm and the bobber out there. 
you know, we're fishing somewhere kind of brown, so we're using something kind of brown, see how it goes. starting to rain. That's nice, I guess. Probably not so good for my phone, but maybe it'll get the flies off Kara. Oh, Kara's catching flies, if nothing else. Can't catch fish, might as well catch flies, I guess. John just getting the last canoe out of the water here. We went through rain and just all kinds of weather right there. I'm the only one who caught fish and I only got one on camera. But John's ready for a beer and a nap. Yeah, I'm sure he's ready for you, Kara. That's what he really wants is a wet dog up on his business. So we're just gonna pack up after fishing and uh, think about dinner probably. Fire should be easy though. It's kebab night at camp. Just got some onions and peppers and beef. Bought a couple glow lures, might try and do some night fishing. It's like night golf. Gonna try and not drown. Just enjoying the campfire at the end of the night. We're gonna go to bed soon. Wake up early. If it's not raining, we'll probably go fishing, but there's supposed to be a big storm coming in, so we might just enjoy that. Good night. Dick tip. If you have to ask if the bugs are bad. <laughs> Dick tip. If you have to ask if the bugs are bad. Yes, the bugs are bad. Bring bug spray and possibly a bug net. Oh, good morning. We got coffee made out here on Fish Lake Island. What is this, the third day of our adventure? John went out for a little morning paddle. Bugs are eating my ankles alive. Oh, I'm sorry. You want to deed up? You want me to help? Bugs have been absolutely intolerable. But if you wear enough bug spray, this place is pretty gorgeous. Like, the weather's held out. We're supposed to get a thunderstorm at some point. It might brew up, but we're gonna, you know, make the best of it and cast around and fish while we can. Oh, we're hitting the late morning. Got the coffee in us, made some bacon. Now we're finishing off with some pancakes. Getting sunscreened up. Got the long sleeve hoodies on. It's gonna be a warm day today. There might be a storm. Doesn't look like it yet, but we'll see. We're gonna do some fishing. There's a bay we haven't been to yet. Check it out. Dip some lines. Probably end up in the water ourselves today because it's so hot. I tied Kara up in the shade. Gave her lots of water because I don't think she'll want to be in the boat in the beating sun. I can't do much about it. So I gave her a big old bucket of water and a pad to lay on and she has lots of shade. She looks happy. Sam looks happy. Happy birthday, Sab. Yay, happy birthday. Happy birthday, Sam. And Dick looks just manly. So uh, we're going to get ready and hit the water and see if we can't catch some fisheries. So I'm just going to spend the next little while catching little panfish. It's better than nothing. It's a lot of fun, man. I'll do this all afternoon. I should go get the guys though. Oh, with just a little bit of worm action, get a little rock bass. Oh no, he can have it, but back to the water, friend. Yeah. Look at that. Man, I can catch these little bass all day on worms. Our heroes return victorious. Having moved the vehicle back to the load site so we can leave earlier tomorrow before the rain. Victory sausage! Word is uh, the rain's not even going to be coming. Not till like tomorrow night. We'll be gone by then. Yeah. Oh, and we're going to spend the night cleaning up camp, eating, drinking, making merry, because it's our last night here celebrating Sam's birthday. Birthday! Yay. Ready to go fishing? We're going to hit the water. Do a little bit of night fishing. All right. Dick tip. Use a red light headlamp to keep bugs away at night. We all made it back in safely. As long as we can cook safely. Just making up some brats on this last night. 
of our Fish Lake Island adventure. Everybody looks great, wonderful. And then we're gonna turn the light off because it's getting buggy. But yeah, we're eating dinner, it's gonna be great. Who knows what the night has in store? Oh, what's that what you got there, John? Got a s'more. S'more what? A little marshmallow cereal treat. Not Rice Krispies, it's fruity dino bites. Should be delicious once it cools off a little. Fire's down to about nothing. Had our sweet treats at the end of the night and took a bunch of evening paddles, saw a bunch of stars. It's time to go to bed. Good night, guys. Tick tip. It's quiet in the UP. Keep it that way. Good morning. Just cooking some breakfast, coffee's done. Got up early, it's a beautiful morning. We're starting to slowly pack up the tents and gear. Everybody's pretty ready to go home. If I didn't get up early and make a fire, we might not even be doing breakfast, because usually we don't. We've uh, been supposed to be rained out quite a few times this year and just get beautiful days like this. And beautiful men like this. That's it. That's all she wrote on Sam's birthday adventure Ooh, to Fish birthday. Lake in the Michigan's Upper Peninsula. We're just gonna rack our canoes up on the canoe rack we made for the trailer, cover the bed of the truck, and uh, head home. Are we done? Yeah. This is the last of it? That's, this is the last this of it. This is the last of it? Well, thanks for watching. This has been My Adventure Life. Please give it a thumbs up and uh, subscribe to our channel and keep checking us out. Thanks, guys. Thank you. Bye.